We got Paul Pierce in the front row. There's 34 over there. Yeah. There's a banner down. There's 17 championship banners up. I mean, there's a space next to him. I, I kind of feel that's going to be number five, but there will be more spaces up there. Kyrie, how important is it to see number 11 up there one day? It's, uh, it's quite important, and uh, I'm, I appreciate that scout I joined in, but I shared it with some of my teammates as well as the organization and everyone else in Boston. You guys will have me back. I plan on re-signing here next year. Boom! So, I appreciate it. Think about Kyrie saying that he plans to resign. I mean, I think that's huge. I think he has understanding after being here a year. Um, you know, it's all about legacy. And to have a legacy here in Boston, uh, it could be like none other uh, in the NBA. I think he has a, a clear understanding of that. He's a smart player. He's a smart guy. He understands that uh, a championship window also doesn't last that long. He had his run in Cleveland, and he sees the future here in Boston to where it could be really something special. And I think he knows that. It's not surprising to me because when you look at his situation, this is like a great situation for him. It's not that he's on a, a team who's getting older. He's in a team that's pretty much can start hitting their prime right now with him being at the forefront and, you know, something that can go on for a long, long time. And, you know, even as he gets older, he has younger guys that can really pick him up if he starts to decline when he gets into his 30s and, and getting older. I mean, this is a perfect situation for him.